8,000 South Africans die every day of AIDS. Millions more in the country are living with the disease. It's an enormous economic, political and social burden. So how can you build hope among South Africans and strengthen their overburdened health system? Well, there were celebrations when the Free State of South Africa agreed to provide life-saving antiretroviral therapy. It was welcome news for those suffering from uh, AIDS. I congratulated the government. At long last, uh, the treatment will be free to the public. That is what we were fighting for. And IDRC was there to support the necessary research to make the rollout smooth and effective. That included finding the best way to manage the supply of drugs. An electronic database was set up to track patients. Nurses underwent special training and surveys were taken to better understand what local people thought about AIDS and the drug treatment. Dr. Ron Chapman, then with the Free State Department of Health, praised the partnership with IDRC. And I must say from, from our side as a, as a Department of Health, we're extremely thankful to, to the IDRC. The approach to delivering ARTs, first tested in the Free State, is gaining traction elsewhere in South Africa. It all means new hope for these orphan children suffering from HIV AIDS. For IDRC, helping to fight AIDS with evidence is making a world of difference.